What do you do here? I can see that you are standing with people outside. Do you walk here or you live here? Yeah, I'm walking inside my good here. Since when have you been staying outside? Uh, since morning, around maybe 7.30 this morning. So from 7.30 till this time, you've not been inside this estate. So how has been situation like? Were you here yesterday? Was it locked yesterday like this? No. So you were able to go in and out since yesterday, but today coming here this morning? And then the Mopo is full inside. Okay, we have, are you telling us right now that there are policemen Mopo inside the estate right now? Yes. So since morning, no one has been able to come out or is it that people cannot just go in? Nobody is going in and come out. I came yesterday, I just saw over more than 100 policemen uh -huh. with AK-47 rifle, fully caught or whatever. I was coming in from Ibado with my wife. So I told my driver to stop. I, I jumped down and I looked around. I saw that they marked some houses for, de for demolition. I said, I, I, how can you do this kind of a thing? Just writing on people's walls without even informing them, without telling them what you intend to do. The security was breached. It was breached, heavily breached. They breached our security. And that was why I said they put us under siege. I don't know whether they have the authority to shoot at sight or to kill, you know, but I told them, I told them that, look, gentlemen, <laughs> you are in Lagos State and we are Lagosians. We will fight it with the last pint of our blood. I can tell you that. The Supreme Court didn't tell them, didn't give a judgment that they have to drive all of us away or demolish our houses. No, they didn't say so. He said, okay, if you are laying claims to a land that was purportedly claimed from you, I think you deserve some compensation, which I think makes some sense. And that was why we said that the Lagos State government will invite them and eventually talk with them and I'll give them some land elsewhere or something. Or if you have undeveloped plots within Magodo, you are located to them, you know, and this that way you can sort out everything. If they, they cannot tell you that, go and approach somebody who has a CFO, go and demolish his house for you to be able to take over, take it over. Why? Are you more of a Nigerian or more of a Negotian than us? You're not. You're not. So please, you know. Yeah, my name is Tokumbo Macaulay. Like I said, I live in this estate. I've been living here for the past about 30 years and I can see I can see this as a problem because <laughs> you can you can you can overcome more greater problems than this one.